Welcome to Genshin Optimizer, where we don't tell you how to play the game. In this guide, I'll show you how to add a new character to Genshin Optimizer. This will assume you already have artifacts and weapons set up. Start by going to the Character tab at the top of the page and then the large plus button to open the character selector. Now select the character you wish to add. In this case, I'll add Hu Tao. Once the page is loaded, set the level at the top left to match a character's in-game level. This is important as it grants access to the higher talent levels just like in-game. The next step is to go to the Talents tab and set Constellations and Talent Levels. Since Hutao infuses her attacks with Pyro after she uses her elemental skill, you have to tell the optimizer this has happened. You do this by enabling the Parameter Papilio conditional state under her elemental skill talent. This is a key step for many characters such as Zhao, Ito and Ayato who self-infuse their normal attacks after using a skill or burst. If you'll be playing Hu Tao under 50% HP to take advantage of her Ascension 4 passive, you must also tell the optimizer this is the case. Now you must equip a weapon, since new characters will come with an unleveled 1 star weapon just like in game. You can change this by going to the Equipment tab, then the Swap Weapon button. I'm going to choose the Staff of Homer for this example. Much like her Ascension 4 passive, you want to tell the optimizer that Hu Tao is going to be played under 50% HP to take advantage of the Staff of Homer's passive. At this point you could add teammates, but we'll gloss over that for the sake of this video. So now you're done with the basic setup, you're almost ready to optimize your character. The first thing you want to do on the Optimize tab is select which 4 set artifact bonuses you want to take advantage of. In Hu Tao's case she can only achieve one stack of the Crimson Witch of Flames bonus. Another popular option is to take advantage of the Shimano's Reminiscence damage bonus. Now you need to pick what type of damage to optimize for. This is where the optimizer is not a substitute for game knowledge. It's a good idea to read some guides, watch some videos, or join our Discord community and ask others what they would recommend. For this example I'll pick Hu Tao's charged attack since it's a common choice. If you only wanted to optimize for a pure pyro Hu Tao, you'd be ready. However since it's common for Hu Tao to vaporize with her charged attacks you must tell the optimizer that this is happening. Now click the Generate Builds button and the optimizer will find the best combination of your artifacts that give you the highest average damage for Hu Tao, with the Staff of Homer, under 50% HP, after using her elemental skill and vaporizing with her charged attack. All that's left to do is equip the build to assign these artifacts to Hu Tao within the optimizer. If you somehow made it here without adding artifacts or weapons, you may be interested in our other guide videos. I hope this guide was helpful, and if you have further questions don't hesitate to join our Discord community to ask for assistance.